Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to be showing you um, how to make this cute little dog right here. This is my cute little puppy I made. And it has um, a nice head right here. You can make it 3D if you want. A little short tail, some cute little feet, and also a little paws right here. If you want to learn how to make one, then stay tuned for this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new and you like my content. Hit the notification bell to never miss an upload and like this video if you like it. So let's get started. So I'm going to start um, colored on one side and white on the other. So let's begin white side up and let's fold it in half. Let's fold it in half. And now we're going to find the raw edge and fold this point to this point. Rotate and fold this edge, this edge. Let's unfold and do the same thing. Now let's unfold, rotate, and make a rabbit ear. So we're just going to make these two creases. Lift this up. So we make on these two creases right here. So you should end up with a long point. And now you can make a crease right here. And fold it both ways. Making a rabbit ear. So you should end up looking like this. So now let's unfold and let's do the exact same thing on this flop. And now after you've done that, let's unfold so you'll end up with two flops here and now let's fold it in half and make sure both flops are facing the same way so it should end up like this now let's let's fold this edge to this edge and turn over do the same thing So now you should end up with this. Now let's fold this flap up, hitting this crease. Like this. And let's fold it over again. Now let's unfold both of them. And kind of completely unfold. And you can see there's a crease here. Let's make that a mountain. Let's also make this a valley. Make these two a mountain. And then the finishing touches these two creases and these two. After that, flatten. So you should end up with something looking like this. So now we're going to do kind of a little bit of a tricky step. Is we're going to pull this flap out. Let's lift this up. And you can see there's a valley fold right here. Let's extend it from here. So you flatten it, looking like this. So now we have this bit over here. Now let's fold this over. Let's fold this over on this crease here, to this crease, I mean. Like this. 
And now we're going to make a little cute little paw thing. You don't want just a pointy thing. So let's just slightly dip our hand in here. Let's pinch this here. Let's form like a square, but don't fold it. After you fold it, fold a triangle. So you should end up with something like this. Now we have to repeat all of this to this side. So you should end up with something like this. Now we're going to make the head. So let's open this up here like this and we're going to make a diagonal fold from this point to this point after that you will end up with a triangle here let's flatten the triangle so you're just bringing this point to this point, making it hit these two points. Now let's open it up and let's fold these two flaps up, well, one flap on these points. Let's unfold and let's fold this point up to this intersection of the crease. And now what we're going to do is pinch this so it's a mountain and bring it up like this. And we're going to make these two points touch each other. Let's open it back up. So you end up with this. And let's pinch it here just a little bit. And after you pinch just a little bit, we can flatten it. So it's like making a pleat. And fold it lightly. After you do that, let's make a V fold here. So let's just adjust the paper so we can squish it. forming a v-fold and now let's bring this flap back up you should end up with something like this let's reverse fold this flap here just like this and now here's a step that you can tear the paper up you want to fold, you want to also do the same step on here. You're making the little nose and be careful. I want to store the paper on here. So you should end up with something like this. And now what you want to do is these two flaps here, let's fold them and hide it behind here. Those are extra flaps we don't want. should look like this and now let's fold these down well we're making the ear so just to taste there you go so now let's focus on the back let's fold it it should hit from this point to this point and we're going to pinch it closer so it stays like that we're making the leg. And let's repeat on the back side. So this is what it should look like when you are finished. So let's fold this flap over. 
so that this point hits this point. Now let's hold this flap to this crease. Let's unfold both of them. And let's make a petal fold. So you have a tall tail. And now the last step is to outside reverse this. And now what you have to do, so let's fold it over so that this point hits this point. So there you have it. I hope you enjoy making this cute little puppy dog. Subscribe to my channel if you're new and you like my content. Hit the notification bell to never miss an upload and like this video if you like it. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.